Okay, I've got this HP Chromebook that I got. Um, I usually, I have this Toshiba that I really like, but it, it turns out to be very fragile. So, I got this Chromebook. It's a 11-1101. It's supposed to have a titanium frame to it, which I liked. And I also got it refurb, so it was cheap. So this was about a hundred bucks, and I figured this I can carry around, and if it breaks, I won't be so terribly upset. I'll probably get used to it, really like it, and that's when it's going to break. But here we go, we're unboxing this. So, lots of cardboard. Oh, it's actually less wide than I expected it. It's, you can see a little bit of wear and tear from the previous owners. This is a reefer? It's a reefer. But, here we go. It's this kind of sharp looking. Does not feel flimsy. It came with the charger. And that's pretty much it. Nothing else. I was expecting a little bit more, but okay. So, let's see where the power is on this sucker. This guy's be around here. Oh, there it is. Power. Power. Well, I guess it needs to be charged. Let's plug her in. So, obviously, this is a Chromebook. It's only got a 16 gig hard drive. So I did go and get an external hard drive to go with it. In case I need to save anything. But being that it's a Chromebook, it's probably going to save everything online anyway. Where is the power? making filming impossible enough. Yes, you are. You're walking in front of the camera. Huh. Just so everybody knows that we are very well aware of of this. Power. Power. Well, that's not happening. I guess I need... Oh! Woohoo! It says chrome. Ooh. Ooh. And we've got our peanut gallery behind us. Okay, so let's the network. Somehow this is worse than a barking dog. Yes, it is. Look at that. And oh, this will let you put a SIM card in, I believe. Which is kind of cool. The stunning typing on the computer <laughs> scene. <laughs> A really long network. There we go. We want a network. Hey. Oh, no, I don't want to make it better. I am a misanthrope. I don't care about anyone. Alright. Oh, now we're going through updates. Well, um, you just got it, and these two updates, because, you know, these things are... They're antiquated by the time you get them. So tell us a little bit more about the the, the features of this, um, what is this, a Chromebook? It's a Chromebook. So basically all it really does is um, run Chrome, at the web browser, so you can run applications out of it. So you can go to, like, Google Docs, you can, you know, go browse the web... You can run applications that you can get out of Chrome. And I just discovered, like, one of the applications I use for work is available through this. So I'm in a pinch and I'm carrying this around and I'm on call. I can just go into it. I know it's a horrible thing. You should have seen that face. But it, um, it works. I mean, it's a, it, it works for, like, just getting online. And you can keep your files offline because I do a lot of writing. So I wanted to be able to have something I could write with without having to carry my regular laptop with fear of breaking it. So, so tell us what uh, what kind of ports does it have? Does it have any? It has USB and uh, audio. How many? Two USB ports right there. Two, uh, okay. And it's got a uh, audio jack, and I think I unplugged it. Oh boy, I unplugged it, so it's out of power. Okay, okay oh well, no. I think that 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 our viewer, viewers. Oh, how much did it cost? A hundred bucks. 
A hundred bucks. Refurb. Refurb. Yep. Through Amazon. So, so what do you think? Well, so far so good. I do need to configure it and see how it performs. It's it's only got two gigs of memory, so I don't expect miracles from it. But I do want to be able to just like get on the web and do my thing. You know, yeah. you know, get online, check my email, write some Google Docs, maybe get on Facebook once in a while. That's about it. Okay.